The year 2025 is approaching. Know x plus 1 over x equals 1. Solve the value of x to the power of 2025 plus 1 over x to the power of 2025. Firstly, what can we do about this equation? It is, of course, a quadratic equation about x, because we can multiply the both sides by x. Then we get x squared plus 1 equals x. There is no denominator anymore, and we're very happy about it. So x squared minus x plus 1 equals 0. Now, maybe your idea is, firstly, we solve for x, and there are indeed two real solutions to this equation, and then substitute them into this term, and then we get the value. It might also be a right way, however not efficient, because for evaluating this term, we need to raise it to a very high exponent, and that is 2 times 25, and for me it is impossible, so we better get a better way. Focus on the form of, that, of the left-hand side, x squared minus x plus 1. It actually has the form a squared minus a b plus b squared, doesn't it? Where a is x, b is 1. And this one actually reminds us a plus b times a squared minus a b plus b squared it is the factorization of a cubed plus b cubed. So that means our this guy is a part of the factorization. It's just a factor of our this term of a cubed plus b cubed. And in our this case, it is x cubed plus 1 equals x plus 1 times x squared minus x plus 1. Very good. So what we're going to do now is multiply the both sides by x plus 1. And the left hand side is going to be x plus 1 times x squared minus x plus 1. The right hand side is still 0 because 0 times anything equals 0. Our left hand side is equal to x cubed plus 1 according to our factorization of a cubed plus b cubed. So we get x cubed plus 1 equals 0. And therefore, x cubed is negative 1. Since x cubed is negative 1, and this is very nice, why? Because notice 2025 is a very nice number. It is 45 squared. 2025 is also the only square number in this century. So 2025 is very precious. 45 is 9 times 5. 9 is 3 squared, so it is 3 to the power 4 times 5 squared. So that's the factorization of 2025. So that means 2025 is divisible by 3. It is 3 times 675. And since we have this one, we can say x to the power of 2025 plus 1 over x to the power of 2025 is also simple and easy. It is x cubed all to the power of 675 plus 1 over x cubed all to the power of 675. Since x cubed is, is negative 1, or this guy. So negative 1 to the power of an even number is still negative 1. So the outcome is negative 2. And that's our answer, negative 2. To get it, give me a thumbs up, subscribe to me for more wonderful questions, and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye!